Hello, I'm Robbie Stiggle, and this is another unboxing. I wonder what this could be. Let's find out. It's from Ontario, California. I think it's from Uplander Guitars. Everybody loves some bubble wrap sometimes. Ah. Looks like a bridge. It's a Floyd Rose Bridge. It's like never been used. This came off of a 1982 Carrera that somebody had built at the Kramer factory on the sly. Comes with the screw in posts, the claw, claw screws, the old claw screws that were shorter. Oh, and ice springs, not super, super tight ones. The ones, these are the ones I like. And the bar. It has the the screw and bar coupling, as you can see. The six millimeter thread. Screws it nicely. Now what I'd really like to do is see if the saddles are legitimate. It's not super, it's not super glossy. These first run Floyds were a rather flat looking covering on them. They were not painted. I must dig out a couple tools for this. Of course, these would be found on the back of one of the headstocks on one of my guitars. Okay, so we've got to loosen these string block screws with, of course, the bigger Allen key. A little bit of rust on them, but not too bad.
with a nice tight uh, fine tuner screws. And then we have the smaller one that holds the saddle in. So we'll loosen those. And be very careful not to lose the block. We flip it over. And it looks like this has two indicator indicator lines on the bottom. I believe. Let's continue. Huh. So far, these are two with one line. Now, if this person had clipped this Floyd from Kramer, there's a good chance that he did not put the saddles in the right order or might not have actually grabbed the correct saddles. Okay, this one has no lines, so that's a tall saddle. That's the D and G strings. Should have no indicator at all. And both of these have no no line. So if these have one, we're hoping that these two have two and that he had put them in the wrong order. Or we might be searching, maybe. No, these have one also. Okay, so I have four saddles that have one scribe and two saddles with no scribes. So I'm missing the two saddles that ha would have two scribes for the uh, both E's. Top girl. Huh? Can you kind of come here? Psst, psst, psst. Zora, what are you doing? What you doing? Are you playing with stuff again? Are you helping me? Believe it or not, this is rather common. When people took stuff from the factory, they couldn't necessarily grab the right saddles or put them in the right order. If we put the saddles back on, putting the two saddles that have no lines, And then the two saddles that have one line. And we sight it. We can see that there is a slight difference in the two saddles that only have the one line. Which is interesting. So the heights are correct. Oh, I see what's going on here. Do you see these two little dots? Those two little dots mean this isn't the right saddle. Those two dots mean that it's off of a some sort of newer Floyd. Floyd 2, something like that. 
So that's a problem because I always want the right saddles. That's why the height is correct, but it's not the original saddle. This one also has the two. Little dots. Although, see, this saddle has two scribes. So, I'm not really satisfied with that because of the dots on it. So, I'm not exactly sure. on that it does have a it does have a flat look to it on the base plate oh there goes one of those blocks The blocks always go in with the uh, with this little cutout piece. Goes to the low part of the saddle. Well, there it is. The five tuners have a good, a good uh, tolerance on them. And thank you for watching. Rock on and have a nice day.